welcome everyone to the Jackpot Journey channel. Um, you know, for, first and foremost, I really appreciate anyone that's uh, checked out my channel and watched the video and liked and subscribed and commented. Uh, it really means a lot uh, and, and it is much appreciated. So thank you. Uh, with that being said, let's get right into it. This is going to be uh, a walkthrough of my favorite and most visited uh, casino um, in Oklahoma. Yeah, it's 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 not the closest to me. Uh, it's about uh, let's just go ahead and put it at two hours. It's about two hours away from me, but this is the casino that I'll travel to um, anytime uh, and most times. And when I'm playing, um, this is where I am playing at. Um, so come on with me and uh, check this out, and we're gonna do a little tour together. Um, this is gonna be the entrance right here. The entrance to the Grand Tower, uh, and this is where you check in. And of course, I've already checked in. We gotta head up to the room. We're gonna go check out the rooms first. Um, the, this is the first room in the Grand Tower. So I did, I did, I did clip two rooms. I did the Grand Tower and the Sky Tower. So this is the Grand Tower. They're they're not a huge difference, but um, the only one that I didn't get is the Spa Tower, um, which is actually, which is arguably probably one of the nicer ones. Um, but yeah, have a look. Um, very nice. It is. This one is freshly remodeled. Uh, they did do redo the rooms. It looks honest, honestly. It looks identical. If you didn't know, um, you wouldn't tell the difference. So this is me doing another intro. But this time I'm walking in to the sky tower. So with me walking into the sky tower, I'm gonna come over, um, check in, and then I'm gonna go back up to the hotel. You'll see me there. here uh, but which is fine because i wanted to, to throw out a couple of, of uh, choctaw facts out to you um first of all the choctaw nation of oklahoma is a thriving nation of nearly 200,000 people uh, and that is within the span of a, a 10,000 square miles uh, of east southeastern oklahoma they are the third largest Indian tribe in the United States, which is just awesome. You know, these are all things that I did not know before. This Durant location is the biggest of the Choctaw casinos, and it is considered the flagship destination. Uh, and it is the second largest casino in Oklahoma. Uh, you're going to be able to tell how big it is. This is, if it's the second largest casino in Oklahoma, it's right up there. Uh, uh, in being one of the largest in the in the U.S. for sure, uh, only second to uh, Windstar. So we'll, we'll do that one another another day. Uh, this is a Four Diamond Hotel with over 1,700 rooms. They first opened in 2006 uh, with the Grand Tower, later expanded to the Spa, and now recently the Sky Tower. This is very recent that they opened the Sky Tower. Uh, they have uh, the slot the slot floor consists consists of over 7,400 slots, over 100 table games, and two poker rooms. Uh, they have 16 restaurants, and the Choctaw Nation has three resorts, with um, with the fourth one opening soon. That one's going to be in Hosha Town. I'm super excited about that one. Uh, it probably won't be the biggest, but it'll be the nicest for sure, because it's going to have that... Um, backwood country cabin feel you know it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty awesome so stay on the lookout for that because um, i will definitely be going there on opening uh, apart from the apart from the three hotels they have four smaller ones uh one mcallister mcallister oklahoma broken bow ida bell springtown uh i've only been to four of the seven but i'm gonna you know of course i'm gonna try to make them to all of them uh check them out uh, the last thing, now that we just showed the rewards, the last thing I want to tell you about is the uh, the tier system. Uh, the, you know, just like all the casinos, they have a little tier system. They do Ruby, Amber, Sapphire, Royal, and Onyx. Me, myself, currently, I am a Sapphire member. Um, hopefully next year, you know, with me stepping on my gambling a little bit, I'll 
try to break through to that royal or uh, oh, I don't think I can make, I, can't, I don't think I can make it to Onyx, but uh, hopefully royal. Um, anyways, we just passed by the gaming center, so this is gonna be the place where all the kids and teenagers like to hang out. They have a movie theater. They have this uh, gaming center or uh, virtual reality. That's what I just passed right now. Uh, they have uh, a bowling. This is the bowling area. It's kind of you can see past there. It's the arcade. Uh, arcade, bowling. Uh, they have special nights uh, where, you know, of course, you know, traditional bowling stuff where they light up the they light up the lanes and everyone has a good time. Okay, so uh, and here's some of the fast food places that they have. So they got chicken place in a bond. Uh, Papa John's. Of course, they have the Burger Place, which is probably the f- a fan favorite. Papa John's and and the Burger Place, yeah, but Smash Burger is gonna be the fan favorites for uh, something quick and easy. Uh, we're gonna cope. You know, the the time lapse makes it seem really fast, uh, but it's actually pretty uh, far away. So it's not far, but like it's a ways to get to the next restaurant, which was Guy Fury. So you see the guy's kitchen there. This is a cool little feature that they have um, in one of the gaming centers. We're going to fast forward a little bit. To the right, we're going to pass. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll catch them on the way back. But anyways, um, this is the Grand Cafe. Really good food. Uh, really good breakfast. Uh, and I really like the experience here that I that I always have a good time. Uh, or I always have a uh, good food when I come here. Uh, it's been a minor times that I haven't had good food. Uh, and of course, at this cafe, I mean, it, this speaks for itself. Pretty awesome. All right, we're gonna keep going forward a little bit, and uh, for now we're gonna pass. Uh, we're gonna be coming up on the Butterfields uh, buffet. Um, really nice buffet always has good food fresh this is probably the place where i eat at the most even though i shouldn't uh it's closed right now when i'm filming this but uh, i'll be able to show a couple snippets of uh, uh of what they have and or me eating there i don't think i recorded a whole lot but walking on down we're doing a full circle um, and the next thing we come to is going to come to the starbucks and then um we're going to be coming to the second parking garage so i'm not sure you know if you remember i passed two parking garages when we were walking when we were doing the drive around but that was the second one uh and then you keep walking past that and uh i didn't get a good shot of it i wish i had uh but you pass gilly's uh restaurant uh that one's more like a sports uh, i don't know how to say that one that was more like a like a Texas Roadhouse kind of, you know, like it has that country feel where they do, and sometimes they do bands and stuff like there too. I don't know what to compare that to, but uh, it's a really good restaurant also, good drinks. And then we get here and this is gonna be the spa tower. So I didn't do any filming inside the um, spa tower like room, but this is gonna be the spa right here. And if this video gets enough views and likes, or if this gets, if they just go up there, I'll, I'll book I'll book a spa t- uh, treatment because inside there is amazing. It's one of the best spas. Uh, I've been to a few good ones in Vegas, but this one's pretty pretty epic. So um, I love the spa here. Going up the elevator, we're gonna get to the Grand Theater. So this is where we do concerts. I'll be uh, I think I'm gonna show a little snippet here of uh, us going to a, to a concert here. It was pretty cool. It was Darius Rucker cut out the music because i'm pretty sure it was copyrighted so uh you won't you'll be able to see what song we're singing but you won't be able to hear no music but uh, it was a pretty awesome concert i forgot to mention this is where they do like giveaways and stuff like that also so if you ever need to know where to come for the giveaways most times it's going to be here uh, this is where also the business center so they do business meetings and they have little areas where you can use laptops and stuff like that too but now to the concert. Now this was an 
epic concert. Uh, if you ever get the chance to see him, take it and go see him because it was epic. Uh, so anyways, we're going to come out of the concert area and we're going to go down. And this, we're back at the front desk here. There's a reward center. We're doing the full loop here. So this is, we're, we're reaching the end. This is the end. Um, there's a couple shops here, a little shopping center. Um, two, there's two shops here. Uh, and then the noodle bar. There was, there's a few things that I missed. One restaurant, which is Salt and Stone. My favorite restaurant. I don't know how I missed it, but I missed it. Salt and Stone, favorite restaurant. And, and the two steakhouses. There's two steakhouses in this uh in the casino, uh, in the resort, and they are both fantastic five-star steakhouses. Uh, this is the last thing I'm showing right here is the workout room. Um, pretty cool, state of the arm, nothing, nothing but new uh, equipment. So if you ever wanna work out, that's where you go. Uh, this is it. I, I really appreciate you guys watching. I, I feel like I went through things kind of fast, but uh, that was the journey. See you on the next one. Like and subscribe, it is greatly appreciated.